It's another day and different beach, a different view in a beautiful Sunday. How are y'all? I hope y'all are doing great. I hope y'all are enjoying the summer. Unfortunately, it's August already. By all means, we already have 20% uh, of the summer left here in Michigan, the state of Michigan. For those of you Michiganders, you already know what I'm talking about. For non-Michiganders, actually the people in the state of Ohio, Illinois, they know exactly what I'm talking about because they, they're in the same boat as we are. So, um, enjoying this beautiful Bishop Lake. And it, it is in Brighton, Michigan. And it's very far away from my house. It took me like about 50 miles um, to get here. So basically, it took me an hour to get here, give or take. But it's a it's a small little lake, but it's nice. And the sun, sun's out, guns out, and all the good stuff. And they got uh, a playground right there. I mean, it's a... Uh, on the water and it, it's looking nice the whole place is very nice beautiful relaxing not not uh that many people in here not as many as uh what i'm used to the other lake that i used to go to had way more people in multiple boats the only boat that i see in here is this fishing boat and it's been there forever and um it looks like this whole lake is not big enough you could jump in whenever whatever you want and start swimming it's not deep enough and it's not scary to swim the water here is super duper good it's not wavy and there's so many of these plants man i'm like surrounded and there's flowers for you ladies all right so I'll, I'll put uh, the address in the description of this little lake for uh, Michiganders. You have to have a recreational pass, a passport. It's a requirement, a recreational passport. If, um, it's It should be listed in your plate, in your registration or your annual registration. Uh, I did not have my, that myself because, you know, I... I never go to these places, so I purchased one earlier, and then yeah, that's it. This is a deal. It's a recreational pass, and uh, it's a beautiful. Excuse me, I'm getting tired because the sun is shining on me, getting some tan, y'all. Um, now I didn't see many people in this lake. I think if I can count them, if I can't like count everybody, I would give, I would say there are approximately 50 people-ish. But the good thing about this lake is there is a camping place where you could reserve, pay a small fee and bring your RV or your camper to here. And then you would have a cam your camper right down there. Where's my finger? Let me zoom out. My finger, your camper right there. And you got your lake right down here. It's a good little vacation spot for the weekend. And then all the beautiful young ladies are right down there. And then um, I, I'm not sure about fishing. I can't. I can't say much about that. It looks like there there are a lot of people fishing in this area, but I mean it's a lake. I don't know if there there's so many. Uh, fishes in this water, but I would hope there is. If not, it's a beautiful view, and that's what matters. And you could bring your camper, park it right over there, pay a small fee with a recreational pass. You're good to go, my friend. You got yourself uh, in this beautiful lake, uh, a lake view uh, camper, I should say. And you could also hook up if you have like an RV truck, like those 28 or 26 RV truck, 26 uh, foot long. Um, those, you could hook up your boat to it. 
get your bikes and then explore this little city brighton i've never been in brighton a friend of mine nick if you're if you're watching this video big shout out to nick my buddy my homeboy if you're watching this video he's a he's a guy that lives here in brighton michigan i would hope nick that you guys have a different lake besides bishop lake because this bishop lake isn't gonna cut it oop, oop, oop. I don't know if you guys heard that, but this was definitely a fish stopping by me. I guess <laughs> I take it back. This lake is full of fishes. Yep, another one right down here. All right, I'm getting way too close to the hands. Let me just move a little bit. Trying not to touch the camera. If you could see her face, she's just swimming. And as you can tell, I bet you she's 5'6, five, 5'5. Five, five. This lake is not deep enough. For me, a 6.1 or 6 foot tall guy. This lake is way too small for me. She's a swan, she's a cruising, she's doing a great job. So yeah, this was, so for Nick, if this is the only lake that you guys have, oh man, you, you shouldn't have a boat. You should just sail your boat. It's a very teeny tiny lake, but it's nice. I like it, me like it, like it, but it's not for a boat, it's for kayaks. I don't believe having a boat in this lake is a good, idea because it's a small one Alrighty, so i'll make it short and sweet it's already seven minutes i've been talking for seven minutes and as you can see there's a beautiful gorgeous looking view um you could swim you could relax you could do it just like what oh, i can't i can't move all right here's my boat you could do just like what this guy's doing where is he at come on camera let me zoom out and then zoom out yep now we're good yeah read the book Study for the bar exam, study for the uh, MCAT, PCAT, uh, CPA exam, and all the good stuff, the exams that brings you money. You could do it by the lake, or yeah. I actually, I, I love studying by the lake, or reading comic books, or uh, fiction stories, perhaps reading anything. It feels so good when you're in a lake reading getting some of that fresh air this lake breeze and basically um sitting or laying down kind of like what i'm doing here in um in a kayak and made it you were basically refreshed that's what i like about the summer i don't know if you guys can agree with me i feel so refreshed during the summer like every time I go to the lake, my freaking mental uh, bra uh, mental brain or my mentality gets refreshed. The, my thoughts, my thought process. It's like I'm a whole brand new person and I'm ready for a new week. And I usually hit the ground ground running the, the coming week after I, I go to the lake. So for those of you that feel the same way, please please hit that like button for me make my day and subscribe for me by the way for those of you that are subscribing uh, to my channel i've, I've gotten uh, multiple different new subscribers thank you so much thank you thank you thank you i appreciate you all you guys i mean i every morning that i wake up i pray to the lord that thank them the lord and god for our blessings and then after that my second step after praying is 
checking out my YouTube channel, trying to see if I hit the thousand or not. It looks like I haven't, I mean, I'm not there yet. I'm like 30 subscribers shy. If you could boost it for me and hit that subscribe button and make my day by 2021, I'm sorry, make my year or my season, my summer season and hit, uh, let's hit a thousand. Thanks uh, for whoever subscribed to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You made my day. Uh, perhaps you made my morning and every day last week. Thank you so much and I appreciate you all. And you guys have been so great to me. And I, I appreciate every single one of you. And with that being in mind, please subscribe for those new subscribers. You know, you would make my day by hitting that red button. So thank you so much. And, uh, Let's continue this journey. Hopefully we'll get somewhere. If not, well, I don't know what to tell you. I'll keep doing my best, trying my best to do some new videos. For those of you that are watching, still watching the video, hopefully you are. Um, there is a boat launch in here and you could also swim in here. And uh, as you can see, it's a kayak launch as well. Uh, and, um, just an FYI, going back to the uh, statement where I said if I know uh, this lake has uh, uh, fishes or not, oh, it looks like it's full of them. It's it, it is they're coming out trying to eat me <laughs> seriously. So uh, this lake is full of fishes. For those of you that love fishing, I would certainly recommend this lake for you. Like I said earlier. I'll leave the link in the description. It looks like those kayaks are free to use. It doesn't look like there's there's anybody that that owns them. So I don't think you have to pay a fee to rent them. These kayaks are free, good to go. This is a good little uh, lake. I like it. Me likey likey. Those people are kayaking. All right. With that being in mind, it's almost uh, it's beyond 12 minutes already. I don't wanna bore you guys. Thank you all for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And if not, please make my day by subscribing. Thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed, stay humble, and it's your boy, Be Adventurous. Take care now. Bye. Let me zoom out. And then peace, y'all. Love you guys.